Alright folks, here's a new amp, it's Fender, it's almost 17 inches tall, and it's about 19 inches wide, so this easily makes it the biggest amp I've ever messed with. Though I'm pretty sure there are bigger, but that doesn't matter. There's a foot switch right up there, and let's go ahead and crank this thing open. So this amp has two inputs. Right here is the first one, it's just got volume, treble, and bass. This is the second channel and all of its options. You got drive, volume, treble, middle, and bass, reverb. Now that, that cable goes to this foot switch right here. You can select your channel and you can do more drive or just plain drive. However, the drive uh, option doesn't really work, so we can't test that out. I can't exactly remember what the pre-out and power in does, but uh, uh, unless I'm forgetting something, here we go. So to honestly test this out, there are no pedals, no effects, except for this foot switching thing. It's actually being used right now. Uh, I press this. While I'm plugged into input two, I'm actually working through input number one, which are these knobs right here. So that's what this thing does. And trust me, it's working. So my volume is only at number two, just to show you how this thing works. It's very volume based. <laughs> Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and switch to input number two. See that light? That means we're on number two. Which isn't that loud to begin with, so. I have no drive and no reverb going on right now. And I'm palm muting. Now let's go ahead and roll that volume back for your sakes and uh, try out the reverb a bit. What's going on? Oh, I'm rolling the drive. Alright. You hear that sound? That's the reverb kicking in. I'm gonna roll the volume back for real. Take off that reverb and put in about shush, put in about five on drive.
the reverb on four more. See, it's still making a psh sound. So there we go. That's the amp. I uh, hope y'all enjoyed that. Bye.